In an effort to become the best version of myself and keep myself motivated towards my goals, I have created a challenge called the 26 by 26. Hi, I'm Sab and I recently quit my full-time job to pursue content creation and to run my small business full-time. I have been so much happier since I've had the freedom to work for myself, but it would be a lie to say that I don't struggle with staying focused and keeping myself accountable to the deadlines I'm setting. That's why I decided to do this kind of crazy challenge called the 26 by 26. Basically, I wrote down 26 goals that I want to accomplish by my 26th birthday on March 30th. This gives me about 20-ish weeks to get everything done and to become this like higher level version of myself. I realized that a huge part of my lack of focus on a daily basis is because I don't have clearly set goals for what I'm working towards. These 26 goals are my motivation to push myself forward to becoming that next level version of myself. It's partly daily habits that I want to implement that I know that I can do but I just can't bring myself the willpower to do. And they're also partly random one-off fun things that I have just put off for years. Now that I have a deadline and now that I have something clear to work towards, I'm hoping that I have stuff that will influence my daily life to be more productive and to be pushing me towards these goals. I always say that I believe the universe will give me whatever I want. I just have to decide what I want. So this is me making the decision to level up myself. This is me believing in myself, working towards the next level up, better version of myself, and just truly staying motivated, staying consistent, and proving to myself that I can do whatever I set my mind to. So in no particular order, here is my list. Number one, become at least a Twitch affiliate. I started streaming on Twitch about a month ago now. If my goal is to become affiliate, then I need to put in the work. I need to put in hours. I need to give myself a schedule to get there by March 30th. Number two, upload 50 videos on YouTube. I did the math and I believe that 50 videos is around two videos a week, which is a great goal to set for myself. Number three, complete a 30 day challenge. Straightforward. Number four, take a pole dancing class. Number five, start a successful TikTok series. The reason I decided start a successful TikTok series and not have a goal to like post a TikTok every day or to get a certain number of TikTok followers is because I think that this is the most sustain sustainable thing for me that gives me enough flexibility in figuring out what type of TikTok content I want to make while still giving myself the pressure that I have to have a series. I'm not really sure what the series is going to be. I have a lot of ideas and I'm just going to do I'm just gonna keep doing them until one of them becomes successful. Number six, read 10 books. I am at zero right now, but I am currently reading a book. Reading I'm Glad My Mom Died by Jeanette McCurdy, and I plan to do a book review on every book I read. Number seven, do the splits. I used to be flexible. I danced my whole life and then I stopped around mid high school and I just wanna be flexible again. Flexibility is also something that I think will keep my body moving. Yeah, do the splits. I think I'm just gonna speed through these now. Number eight, average 10K steps a day. Number nine, be 100% debt free. Number 10, sew a coat. Number 11, embroider a large back piece. Number 12, get a new tattoo. Number 13, hit my weight goal. So basically lose about 30-ish pounds. Number 14, make myself a pair of tailored pants. Number 15, release two collections for my brand. So two fully thought out collections that have at least 
five pieces or more. Number 16, throw knives with 60% accuracy. I have not talked about this, but I really love knives. I started adding knife throwing in my daily routine. I'm gonna upload a vlog about my daily routine and that has some knife throwing in it. So stay tuned for that. Or maybe I did it already, I don't know. 17, learn more Bali song tricks. Bali song is butterfly knife and I um, have a practice butterfly knife. I don't have it with me, but I'll make some content on it at some point. Number 18, make a streamer friend, but in parentheses, anyone I know, like I a friend that I currently know that decides to stream counts. I don't believe that content creation should be solely by yourself. I want to meet people to ask them questions. I want to grow with people. I want to motivate each other. I, I'm doing this because I want to build a community. Number 19 is similar. Make a YouTuber friend. Someone who specifically I can go to to talk about content ideas with. Who maybe wants to do challenge videos or vlogs together. Make a YouTuber friend. Same thing applies. If I know someone and I convince them to fully pursue YouTube, then that counts. Number 20, get to a chess elo of a thousand. This one I'm a little nervous about, but I love chess and I want to motivate myself to practice and learn more. So a thousand elo by March. It gives me like three months. I think I could do it. I don't know. We'll see. Number 21, design two new sets of stickers. Put my graphic design skills to the test and sell them through my brand Blush Spice. Number 22, this is a one-off fun one, go to a pottery painting place. This is something I did every year with friends and family and I kind of just miss it and I want to hang out with friends and family. I want to, I want to be interactive in social situations that are a little different, like not just getting food or going shopping. 23, go in public and play chess with a stranger. This is an idea I've had for a while. I want to just take my chess board, sit in a park and just hope, see if someone comes play, comes and plays with me. I think it'll be fun and it'll be fun to, it's always fun to play people in person and to meet new people. So there we go. Number 24, travel abroad or have a serious trip planned. I really want to travel next year. I don't know how I'm gonna get it done, but it's about time. It's something I want to do. Fingers crossed it happens. Number 25, sew through all the fabric I have. At my studio, I have just boxes and boxes of fabric that I just need to get rid of. And why not get rid of it through sewing through it? Number 26, get Blush Spice products in a retail store. I am excited for this one because it's a big, it's kind of the biggest goal I have for my business. If I can get space in a retail store, it's slightly more passive income and that's a huge win. So there we go. That is my current 26 by 26 list. I will try to post updates uh, as often as possible. I will probably do most of the updating on TikTok. Countdown to my 26th birthday begins now.